protect your DNA. BioPQQ can promote formation of new mitochondria. InfoWarsStore.com now let's talk about some news that are, that's going on foreignly because we hear a lot about women's rights here in the United States. And of course, we know things aren't exactly perfect here in the States, but when you think about things that are going on overseas where they're arresting women uh, for driving cars, or they're stoning women if they dare not wear the, the full burqa and all these other things, and then you come over here and, and they're telling young ladies to get bent all out of shape if somebody uh, says something mean on Twitter. People say mean things to me on Twitter. People say mean things to Joe Biggs on Twitter. You say something mean to Joe Biggs, you're going to have a very lively conversation on your hand. Basically what I'm saying is you don't curl up in your safe space and you know turn off the lights and say the whole world is against you. You stand up on your ground, you fight back if necessary, and a lot of people, if you just ignore them, they go away. But here's a real war on women, in my personal opinion. Brother of Pakistan's social media queen, I'm proud of killing my sister. After going on the run, her brother was later arrested. In his confession video, he expressed no regret. I am proud of what I did. I drugged her first, then I killed her. She was bringing dishonor to our family. And this is what you see a lot going on in foreign countries, these uh, honor killings. This person brought dishonor to our family, whether they were living a uh, lucid lifestyle according to the family or there's some other issue going on. Uh, somebody takes it upon themselves to mutilate the person, to hurt the person, to kill the person, to you know ship this person off to slavery or whatever else because they just felt dishonored by the actions of the individual. The sister rose to fame due to her sassy and increasingly political videos she posted on video on Facebook. Her brother claims that having his friends share her pictures and video clips was too much for him, and killing his sister was better than killing himself. The sister referred to herself as a modern-day feminist and had nearly 750,000 followers on Facebook. And her brother was quoted as saying, girls are born to stay at home and follow traditions. My sister never did that. And these are the type of things we talk about when we talk about a war on women. It's not, you know, banning bossy and, you know, whether the new Ghostbusters is good or bad. And I just couldn't believe that this Ghostbusters thing has become such a national issue. And I'm like, I mean, if you want to make a movie with, you know, female Ghostbusters, like, that's your business. But I don't see why that's like the biggest controversy in the world next to, you know, Pokemon Go or, or whatever else is uh, currently in the news cycle. Now, this is something that is uh, comparatively a much bigger deal. Uh, Turkey reportedly detained 103 military officials, cancels vacation after a failed coup. Turkey detained a total of 103 generals and admirals for questioning and canceled all vacations for public workers. Part of the government's latest crackdown over a failed coup that left hundreds of people dead, Turkish media has reported. Separately, Turkey's interior minister reportedly sacked over 8,000, close to 9,000 personnel across the country, including 30 governors, 52 civil service inspectors, and 16 legal advisors. The government has blamed the failed coup, which led to the deaths of nearly 300 people and wounded 1,400 others on supporters of U.S.-based Muslim cleric Gullen. So it's a, it's a pretty big deal. I've seen the pictures of they got all these guys lined up in handcuffs, and it, it was just a weird scene. They got the shirts off and all this stuff. And, of course, uh, you got the nearly 300 people dead and all the people wounded. So it's a pretty big deal, and we'll see what develops here coming up in the near future. Now, to bring things back to the states, let's talk about reefer madness. They're saying that medical marijuana is already saving $165 million per year for Medi Medicare. And this is a new study in the journal Health Affairs. The bottom line, in 2013 alone, when 17 states had legalized marijuana, le uh, me medical marijuana, Medicare saved over $165 million. The authors, a father-daughter team at the University of Georgia, looked at over 87 million prescriptions from the Medicare Part D database, focusing only on conditioning, conditions where marijuana might serve as an alternative treatment. Now, when it comes to marijuana, I'm not telling anybody to go out there and smoke it recreationally, but I do understand that there are medical benefits to it. And people say, well, you can get you know, the fraud with the marijuana. You can get people just go in there and just try to get it for whatever reason. You can do the same thing with Oxycontin. There are people that abuse any number of prescription things, so I don't think it's fair to just uh, scapegoat marijuana because some people don't like it. Uh, you can get high as a kite off many things. You can make purple drink off Robitussin. 
You know, so, so to say you shouldn't have marijuana, it just doesn't make sense to me. And our, our last story here before we go into more special reports, things going on at the DNC, excuse me, the RNC rather. Hundreds of men sleeping on the streets of Queens for a shot at a plumber's union apprenticeship program. And this is pretty much my sign of the times where you have 1,000 applications are handed out in order on Monday after tests and interviews. Only a percentage are accepted to the five-year program. And they say that you got a lot of guys fighting for these very few jobs, and that's pretty much a sign of the times. You got all these guys out in the streets, and they just really don't have anything for them to do. Introducing Secret 12, the new InfoWars Life Vitamin B12 formulation. Now, InfoWarsLife.com is excited to announce that we can bring you our most bioactive, powerful form of B12 that has been developed with our exclusive perfected process. Secret 12 is a binary of nutramedical grade, bioavailable coenzyme forms of B12. Secure your revolutionary Secret 12 formula right now at InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139.